Hello everyone and welcome to a new preparing my binders for upcoming comebacks video. Um, actually a lot of these comebacks have already happened <laughs> but I'm just a little bit behind in setting up my binder for some of these um, releases. So we're gonna go a little bit back in time, we're gonna do a little bit in the future and yeah. So as you can see as per usual I have set myself up for hopefully some sort of success by pre-organizing myself in this notebook as I usually do. So I will show you really quickly. I just kind of wrote down what I need to prepare for for each member in these groups in my binders, if that makes sense. So we are going to be preparing my binders for Very Very, Stray Kids, TXT, Cravity, On and Off, The Boys, and CIX. So there's a lot to go through. Hopefully it won't take me too long. I hope this video isn't forever in a million years long either. Um, and of these groups, On and Off and The Boys have already made their comebacks. So yeah, let's just get started because this is gonna take me a hot minute. Um, the supplies that I use, for those who don't know, we have Ultra Pro 9 Pocket Pages. I only really set up for um, photo card size items that will fit in a 9 Pocket. Everything else I kind of just go with the flow in my sorting and organizing photo card videos. I don't actually like write out little, you know, notes and placements for each of the larger inclusions just for the 9 Pocket Pages. So, Ultra Pro 9 Pocket. Then we also have some Ultra Pro White um card sleeves that i use to just kind of act as fillers we have some sticky notes that i got at the dollar store that i just kind of use to write what needs to go in each place we have my favorite pen somebody asked about it last time so it is the papermate inkjoy gel 0.7 love that pen this is my last one one of mine ran out of ink already and i'm like how when what so i need to buy some more um this notebook I got at Muji, if anyone cares. And yeah, and then we have my iPad here just to kind of show you the different items that come in each of the albums. Even though I have it already written out, just want to have an extra little visual for you. And then you can see the reflection of my lamp. But yeah, not much I can really do about that. So yeah, let's begin. Okay, so let's move some of these items out of the way for now. And then let's take a closer look at Very Very. So I collect two members. I collect Gehan and Min Chan. And for each of those members, we have a lock version photo card, a sync version photo card, and then a reality version photo card, three of them per member. So there's a total of five photo cards per member. Um, I don't know why I only took out nine pocket pages. I'm gonna have to get my binders out because for groups like Very Very, actually for all of my binders really, um, I kind of just, continue if that makes sense like I don't divide the arrows I just kind of continue putting the photo cards in order so I'm going to move this out of the way we're going to grab the very very binder and uh yeah we'll get started okay so here begins the very very section but let me get to the end of Gehan, which is right here and as you can see I'm still missing one of his IDs from their previous release but I do have it on the way so that's exciting for me um so yeah like i mentioned we have five items to prepare for here okay so i have five little white sleeves here and we're going to just start writing so i'm going to write lock sink and then reality one my writing is messy today reality two and reality three so that is it for Gehan. so let's stick these to the white pocket pages or card sleeves i should say and there we go so i'm gonna do lock first then sink like so and then i need a new nine pocket page for the rest so we'll do reality one reality three and reality two there we go and then some more white pocket 
sleeves for the rest. And there we go. So that is it for Gehan. I'm going to put this page in here. Like so. And then we can move on to Mint Chance. So these are all just special cards for Gehan, which I do hope to collect more for this era. And then here we have Min Chan, who I am so excited is back. So for those who don't know, Min Chan was on a bit of a hiatus recently, but he's finally coming back. And I'm so excited to be able to collect him a little bit more again. I don't know why I'm taking more white sleeves when we have them right here. Um, so yeah, very excited about it. We're going to write the same thing for Min Chan. His will all fit on this one page. Since he wasn't here for the last comeback, um, we still have a few more spots left for his cards. So yeah, I'm happy they'll all be able to be together on one page. All set up for Min Chan. So as a visual, here's what the photo cards look like. We have the lock sync and reality version. I forgot to show that earlier. And then these are the kind of larger items I was talking about that I don't physically like write out sticky notes for because I just kind of go with the flow and put them in my binder when I get them. So we'll have a four cut photograph for each of the versions for the lock and sync. And then for the reality, we get a Polaroid, which is really nice. So very excited about that. What is happening here? Okay. So next up, the group that we're going to be setting up for, is there any that are in this binder? CIX. Let's go to CIX. That way I don't have to take this binder off of my table. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Okay. So here we have CIX and I collect soon for those who don't know. For the first album, I did collect everyone, but for the rest, we only did some moon and we do have a lot of spots left for his photo cards. There we go. So as I have it written, there is a, there's two photo cards per version. There's three versions of the album. And then there's also three scratch cards. So as you can see here, we have the selfie photo cards. You only get one of 10, but there's two per member, which is kind of annoying. So we get uh, two for ripple, two for wave, two for storm. And then down here, you can see there's also postcards and whatnot, but there is this scratch message card. Now I don't know, judging by this sizing, I don't think it's actually gonna fit in a nine pocket. So I am not gonna set up for that. We are only gonna set up for the photo cards. This website glitches so bad on an iPad. Here we go. So yes. Okay, so I'm gonna use green sticky notes this time. We're gonna write ripple one, two, wave one, two, and storm one, two. I'm gonna do this in fast motion, double, double time, double speed, whatever you want to call it. Okay, and now that those are all written out, I'm going to go ahead and stick them onto the white pockets. That's all set up for as well. Didn't take too long, which is nice. Um, for this era, I believe I'm only gonna be purchasing one version of the album. I'm trying to, you know, slow down my album collecting because I don't have all the space in the world and albums take up a lot of space. 
so um yeah that's why uh i'm only gonna be buying one version but i am still gonna be collecting all the photo cards i know it's gonna be difficult because he is pretty popular and um i don't know i just find finding his cards on mercari can be a little bit of a difficult process but i'm gonna try so and that is that okay so we have done very very we have done cix let's move on to let's move on to the boys how about that okay so next up let's set up for the boys for those who don't know i currently collect hyunjae but i used to collect hyunjun so we keep this little nine pocket page here um i never collected him fully i just kind of got a nine pocket page of my favorites and left it at that but um i recently said in a video that i was not going to be collecting hyunjae anymore and i quickly changed my mind so we have reveal we have the stealer um and then at the back here we have some postcards which i'm going to leave here we're going to have to add a new nine pocket page since there is no room left on the other one so yeah let me grab one of those all right so let's pop this in here and as you can see for the boys there's quite a lot of things here we have a okay let me let me get this straight so we have three versions of the album we have kick bang and splash for each version let me, we're not even going to talk about these things yet because I feel like, I don't know, like you can pop them out, but I don't want to pop it out, I don't think. I don't really know what I'm going to do. So yeah, I'm kind of not sure if I want to set up for this one card. Let me do some math really quick. So for the photo cards, we get one sparkling perversion, right? Yes, I believe so. And then for the photo cards, you get two, but I believe there is three per member. So, <laughs> math, how many photo cards are we putting in here? Let me see, let me see. I think what I'm gonna do, because there's three per member per version of just regular photo cards, that's what this nine pocket page is gonna be. And then the nine pocket page on the back will have the three sparkling photo cards, but then I think the express ticket, pretty sure there's oh my god stop glitching i think there's only one like you can like there's no differentiation between the different album versions if i'm not mistaken so i don't think i don't think i'm gonna set up for it because i'm probably just gonna keep it attached i don't know i don't know but for now let's go with the three what is it thrill version bang version and splash versions okay i'm gonna do that in double time the speed Okay, and there we have that first page. Now, I also forgot to mention that I was planning on only purchasing one version of the boys' uh, new album, and I don't know if I'm still gonna do that or not. <laughs> um, Hyunjae can be very difficult, and I feel like I need to increase my chances of just pulling him from the get-go, and even like having more cards to trade for him is probably smarter than just buying one version and trying to buy the rest of his cards later on Mercari, because he can be a little bit pricey on there. So I'm thinking I'm gonna buy a full set, but probably only end up keeping one version like I have with previous The Boys albums. Um, so yeah, decisions that I need to make, but we'll probably make that decision upon my next paycheck. <laughs> so there is that page, but I still need to do one more nine pocket page for the, um, what were they called? The sparkling photo cards. Now I believe there will be 
three of them total, one per version for Hyunjae. So there should be one for the, what is this, the splash version? And then if I scroll, there should be more. Yes, so I believe there's three different versions of that. So let's write that out really quickly. And there we go. My writing is disgusting right now. But what's really cool about these sparkling cards, I don't know if you guys have seen them in action online on Twitter or elsewhere, but basically I think there's like an app you download and you like, it's kind of almost like an AR card, but like the glasses light up. I don't even know, it's really cool. I don't know how to explain it properly, but I'm very excited to try that out when I get one on hand. But yeah, let me just pop some more white pockets in here. it in here and there will be more postcards and stuff as mentioned i don't actually like write out sticky notes for the larger inclusions so we will just put those away when we get them but the postcards do look really pretty where are they here's one and they're holographic which i'm very excited about so yes now let's see the boys is done so we can move on to i believe on and off is also in this binder so let's move on to them Okay, so for On and Off's new album, I am planning on only purchasing one version as I have in the past. I found that buying Hyojin's cards hasn't been too difficult. I don't collect usually every single thing. Um, I usually just kind of trade what I pull for some of his cards, but I have been buying a few on Mercari when I see them, so maybe it will transform into me <laughs> buying all of his cards. Um, there's not that many, so it's not that bad. But um, yeah, so I guess we have one more spot, but I do have more of these photo cards. That's the thing with him is that I haven't set up for all of his cards because I don't know if I want to collect every single thing. So maybe I don't need to set up for him. I don't know. There's a lot though. I'm probably planning on buying the minus 10 version. Do I set up for just those two? Do I set up for them all? I don't know. What do I do? I feel like I might have to actually set this up off camera because if I... I think I do want to try and collect his older cards. Not older, but like for this era, for example. What era was that? My name era, I don't nearly have enough. I know I have bought a lot of his, um, what was this era? <laughs> City of On and Off. Those are coming. So I feel like I kind of want to set this up properly, but it's just going to take up too much time in this video. So <laughs> while I had intended to set up for them right now, I think I'm going to hold off and do that off camera. And then when I start putting photo cards away, you'll see in future videos how I ended up setting up for it. But yeah, I think I'm going to wait on that. So yeah, let's move on to Cravity next. How about that? Okay, so for Cravity, as many of you know, I recently decided to stop collecting Hyongjun and only collect Taeyang. And then I've also decided I will not be purchasing any albums for them in the future, but only purchasing Taeyang's photo cards. So this first page is complete, so we're going to have to work on a, nine, a new nine pocket page because this page back here is just some special cards of his. So we have a new nine pocket here. And as I have written down, and as you can see here, there are three versions of the album and there's only one photo card per member per version. But then there's also these unit cards and I don't know who's gonna be in a unit with who. So I have it kind of question marked. I'm not gonna set up for them just because I literally have no idea if there's gonna be like multiple versions with Taeyang, if it's gonna be like multiple versions with him and one other member only, if there's gonna be a lot, like I don't know. So I don't know how to set up for it or what I even want. I won't know until I see it probably, but we can set up for his three photo cards. So we have the awake version, the take version and the youth version. So let me go ahead and start writing those out. All right, so those are written out and I'm gonna get some white pockets for them. 
There we go. I'm actually so disgusted by my writing today. I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's the way I'm positioned, the way I'm standing, but I just feel like I can't write neatly today, <laughs> like at all. So anyways, here we go. Move you out of the way and we're just going to put them up top. And there we go, that page is complete. Just gonna flip that over, pop it in. And yeah, very excited to see what they release, or not what they release, but what this album is gonna sound like. I'm very excited for it. So there we go, Cravity is all done and set up for. So here we go, they are done. We're gonna do on and off, off camera. So we have TXT and Stray Kids left to go. So let me, let's do TXT. Okay, so for TXT, I'm also only planning on buying one version of the album. Um, there is two versions and there is, I wrote times two, but I think there's only one photo card per member per version. So yeah, I think I misjudged that. However, they just released like a new version of the album. I'll pull up those album details in a minute, um, but it's kind of confusing to me. I don't, I don't know. So anyways, for these, we have the fight together version and the escape together version. So here is Taya, uh, sorry, Taehyun, and we're gonna fill in these little sections here. So that's basically it. I'm pretty sure there's no other nine pocket page size items. Well, I don't know what this is, but the sizing is not correct. And then there's this sizing is correct. What is it? The story. So it's kind of like one of these things again, the OS card. So I will write that down. I don't know how I missed that in my initial planning. Is it just OS? Okay, hold on. That looked ugly. There we go. So we have those three, but then let me pull up the new version of the album. So then we also have this and it's kind of confusing me. <laughs> it looks like they're still called Fight Together and Escape Together, but they're smaller, they're squares. Do they come with the same things? Definitely not. It looks like there's one photo card per member per version again. Honestly, I don't know why they did this and it came out afterwards, so Ugh, I hate it, but <laughs> okay. So what? how do I even label these? They're literally the same version names. Is the album still called the same thing? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna write Fight Together 2. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody educate me because clearly, why'd I write one? <laughs> okay, <laughs> let me take this one and write two on it. But yeah, I don't know if I'm just stupid, if I missed what the heck this is supposed to be, but we'll put a one on you and then escape together two. Yeah, I don't know, but I think I'm still gonna do like fight together one, fight, or sorry, escape together one, and then the OS for this to complete this first page at least because I feel like because they came out of the same album they should go together and then these two because there's no other nine pocket sized inclusion that comes in this so these two are just gonna have to oh my god these two are just gonna have to be on their own here we go and I'm gonna have to get a new page for them as well so fight together too Escape together too. And new nine pocket page. Here we go. And there we go. Yeah, very odd, but it is what it is, I guess. Pop that in. And TXT is done, I think, I hope. I don't know, unless I'm missing some other sort of detail, but I think 
that is it. So TXT done. And now we can move on to the final one, which is probably one of the bigger ones. And that is Stray Kids. Okay, so moving on to Stray Kids. For those who don't know, I collect Chengbin and Lino, and I used to collect Felix as well, but I recently decided to no longer do that because three members was too many for me to collect from this group. So we do have the standard versions of the album as well as the limited version, which I have ordered both of. So as you can see written here for the standard version, we have Chengbin for regular photo cards as well as Lino for regular photo cards. Then we have a Changbin double-sided, a Lino double-sided. The Changbin frame and the Lino frame for pre-order is that nine pocket page sized? Yes, it is. Good, good, okay. And then for the limited version, we have the photo card set, which I don't think I wrote here. Um, so yeah, a lot to write down. Wait, a set? Is it really a set for the limited? I'm gonna, I'll check that after, but for now, Let's move ahead. So where did we leave off with Changbin? How many slots do we have? We have six slots left. There are four regular and then a double-sided. So I think we're good. I think it'll all fit here. So amazing. Let's write it down. All right, so there is that page for Chengbin. I'm quickly gonna check, just double check the limited version because I'm kind of confused by, why, by what I have written down. So one second. And I don't think I filmed any of that. This video is a mess, isn't it? <laughs> but we just set up for Lino's um, and yeah, all done. So sorry about that. I feel like that happened last time to me with SF9. I just like completely did not film any of me putting away Jayun or setting up for Jayun. But um, yeah, so Stray Kids is now complete. I'm not gonna set up for the photo card set since we're getting the whole thing. I'll just pop it into a nine pocket page when they arrive. Um, but yeah, I think we're done. I think we set up for everything. This video is probably a little long and I feel like I was a little bit of a hot mess throughout the whole thing, but I hope it turned out well. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.